about the network edge and how access is provided to the end system at the edge of the network. Now, let's briefly explore the core of the network and how it interconnects the access networks connecting the end systems. The internet connects end systems together to communicate with each other. The network core is an interconnected mesh of switches and routers connecting access networks together, making this communication possible. These routers and switches perform packet switching. This means that they help deliver small chunks of data called packets between the sender and the receiver. To better understand this, let's take a step back and explore switching. We have links and switches that connect those links together. Delivering data between a sender and a receiver. This delivering happens by going through these links and switching among them. Switches sit between the links and make connections between their incoming and outgoing links. This determines which links or resources are used between the sender and the receiver. There are two fundamental approaches to switching data through a network of links, packet switching and circuit switching. In circuit switching, the resources along the path, which are, for example, links and buffers, are reserved for the whole duration of the communication between the end systems. This end-to-end -end reservation or connection is called a circuit. In packet switching, the resources along the path are not reserved. 